Okay, so first question, what interested you uh, with a job with the Secret Service? Um, difficult question. I don't know if I can answer that because I'm under legislation to not talk about it. But I can give you, I love James Bond. So mm. that was an inspiration for We me. do get a lot of that. Um, you know, is there, is there, is there any, any more you can give me? Um, you know, this is a very I like prestigious guns. job. So it's a lot of work. I like guns. Okay. And I, I felt if I joined the Secret Service, I could shoot people on the sly and not and get away with it a right. lot. So yeah. um, Okay. Um if we just move on to the um what what attributes do you think you have that, that, that suit you to this role? I've got muscles, brawn, I'm particularly good at sniping. And uh, I, what, can I just stop you there? No you experience? can't actually. I, I like oh. to finish. Oh. Um, I love bungee jumping. Yeah, can I, I, I okay. am, you know, this is sure, an carry on. a two-way thing. I sort of generally ask the questions sure. and you, you respond to them. Okay. Um, so in, in, with, with sniping, what, what experiences have you had there? I've coated myself in glue and plastered myself in pieces of small green paper, crepe paper, to look like a sniper. I haven't actually sniped properly. Oh, I see. Um, I had a go, uh, it was Halloween, and my next door neighbours had some pumpkins lined up and a snipe at them. And that's it. Right. Um, previous job roles, um, yeah. you, this, you've left this section blank. I don't like to go into it. Let's just say it involved a mop in the back of co-op. That's all I'm saying. So you work for the co-op? As a, as a I was an affiliate, yeah. But I didn't work for co-op directly. I felt I was above it. Okay. Um, My mop was terrible, by the way. Right. Um, if you were in a one-on-one -on -one confront confrontation with someone... Um, Which I often am. Good, good. Um, how, do, how do we normally deal with that? If it's getting it's rather heated and, and someone, someone's coming for you, yeah. someone's uh, looking to act in a violent way, what would be the first thing you do? I attack the feet. People don't expect the feet, mm -hmm. so I slide down low and I grab the feet together. It makes him a bit uneasy, he falls over, and then I'm on the neck and I kick his face in. Right. Okay, and, and, and say we need this, uh, this particular person, there may be a witness, they may be important to a case we're dealing with, yeah. um, and we need information from them. Mm -hmm. You're going in to interrogate them. Sure. What are you going to do? How are you going to get this information from them? I ask them nicely to begin with, once, and then I'm slapping around the face with a metal glove. And I keep doing it until there's blood, a lot of blood, I like blood in interrogations. And then I'm on the nuts if it's a guy. Grab them first, give them a little pull, and then twist them. He's often, by that point, all the information's out and I have a little go. Even though he's giving me the information, I keep going. So this is a tried and tested method of yours? Yeah, definitely. Can you give us a specific example of, of someone you might have done this to? I can't talk about that. Oh. I'm in the Secret Service, I'm sorry. Well, well this is not, not, not quite yet. Um, well, this, I, yeah. I, I feel like I am. Oh. oh Therefore, I am. That's great. Um, are you on any medication at the moment? A lot. I'm on edge right now. Yeah. I feel like I want to flip something. Because uh, for, for the right candidate for this job, we, we kind of want someone who's, you know, able to, to maintain a... I mean, know. I only have 20 different types of tablets, so I feel only like... Only 20? Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah it, can, it only takes me a couple of hours to get through them all, so that's at least, like, 12 we, we, hours. Yeah, we'd obviously have to take that into uh, consideration. Okay. Um, well, that's, that's sort of our, our basic questions. I'm just going to ask a few um, general questions now. I don't read too much into them. Just sort of like to know a bit more about sure. you, okay. your personality. Um, so, what's the uh, what gets you out of bed in the morning? What what's what, what drives you on? Usually, my alarm clock. It's very loud, so I get up. Okay. If not, I just stay in bed. It's usually the alarm clock which gets me up in the morning. And just to conclude, um, we're obviously interviewing a number of people for this position. Um, Are you? What, what can I take from you? What can you give me in terms of how do I remember Chris Trott? How can you not remember me? 
I think, is what you should be asking yourself. I mean, I obviously look like a secret agent guy. I have numerous skills of sniping with pumpkins, as I've mentioned previously. I love bungee jumping. As I reckon there's a lot of bungee jumping in Secret Service, personally. And I reckon that's an attribute I definitely have. And I love parachuting, actually. I love parachutes here, there, and everywhere. Great. That's, uh, thank you very much. Thank you. That's, uh, uh, we'll let you know in due course. You better do. Yes, thank you.